Hi everyone, this is Tina. Welcome back to my channel and um, welcome to a collective haul today. I'm also going to share um, two Christmas cards that I got in the mail um, from my crafty friends. So the first one comes from Sue Narco um, here on YouTube and um, look at this cute card and his legs move back and forth. I think this is a Sizzix die um, because Tanya Olsen give, gave me um, a snowman one that his legs move but that is so cute warm wishes and then she's wishing me a merry christmas and a happy new year and it folds like it opens like this so you have like this page here that has the opening that you can see the background with that's really neat so thank you sue thank you so much if you're watching i really appreciate you thinking about me and then the next card is from Rhonda Coleman. And Rhonda sent me a cute little Santa outfit um, card wishing me a uh, Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year again. Thank you so much, Rhonda. That was so sweet of you to think of me. You ladies are so awesome. I love receiving um, little things like this. Even just a card is so um, thoughtful and sweet. So thank you very much, ladies. You guys, this is a collective haul. I've been collecting these things for probably about two weeks. They're slowly trickling in. Um, I do have a couple more things coming, but I'll do a video once I receive everything else that I have, okay? Um, okay, so let's get started. So I went over to Gina Marie Designs. I ordered this Grinch stamp because Kimbo Creations um, showed this on her page. And when she showed it, I told her that CC Designs has a Grinch um, stamp. She ran over there to get it, and I ran over to Gina Marie to pick this one up. It's so cute. So you have the gifts, the hat, his face, his hand with the um, ornament. You got a little tree there. Um, the sentiments are funny. It's um, it's because I'm green, isn't it? <laughs> Merry Christmas. You're mean. You're a mean one, Miss the Grinch. And maybe Christmas, he thought, doesn't come from a star. Maybe Christmas perhaps means a little bit more. That's so cute. I just love the sentiments. And I think I can mix, mix and match it with the C, um, CC Designs one. You know, with the sentiments and stuff. And then while I was over there, I picked up some of these... Um, enamel dots i love her enamel dots they're really really pretty and these are like a um you can see through them kind of like a water drop it's so pretty and i love these colors and then i got these and these have uh are just like the first ones that kind of like you can see through them very pretty i should have got some red because i just realized that i don't have much red and then these I got, and she put a little thank you on here and gave me a die. Um, but here's the, this. these have glitter, and I love these blue ones. But these have actual glitter in them. And then the little thank you, and then she gave me um, a little die with little mice. So those would be really cute to throw into projects. So thank you for the freebies. Um, really appreciate it. So there's that. And then I went over to CC Designs, and this is the Grinch one that CC Designs has. It's really, really cute, and it's that whole actual Grinch. I've seen some projects from the design team making these, and I've seen them over on Pinterest, and the cars were so, so cute. I had to go over and grab this stamp set. And this one says, Grinch, please, bah humbug, and Merry Grinchmas. <laughs> This face on that one just kills me. Look at the face. He's so funny. Um, she doesn't have like a colored picture in the back. So it makes it easier when they do. Um, and while I was over there, I decided to pick up this one. They do have uh, a new release. I think I think this was part of the new. No, there's another um, new release since this one. So this one here is um, Holiday Animals. I don't know what this was called. Green one. This is called Green One. This is Holiday Animals. And these animals are so cute. Look how adorable they are. I just love this one here with the little Santa hat. The little cat with reindeer antlers. This one is baking. Has um, a cookie sheet of gingerbread cookies. 
and then it has a chef hat and then here's the lion is a lion or a dog oh that's a dog i'm sorry this one's the lion this is a dog so very very cute oh my gosh so cute all right and my adornment came in i had ordered this apple stamp um when it was on pre-order and I know we got the apple recipe um, one in our club kit, but this one has where you can take the middle out. So it would be a solid apple. And if you watch my channel, you remember during the um, summer months I had made, or the fall, I think it was, I made pumpkin faces with the, um, oh gosh, peachy cane faces. And I thought, how cute would an apple be as well? And I liked this one because it, you can take this out and it would be a solid apple. And then you just stamp the peachy keen face in the middle. So I was happy to get that. I waited a long time because, like I said, it was on like a pre-order. And I waited for it to come in. Um, but and it has other things here. Hey, you have an apple, an apple eaten with a bite out of it and a solid. And then you have this little uh, border strip. And it looks like it says something. Does it say something? No, I think it's. I think it looks like ruler lines. I thought it, maybe it said something, but it's got these little ruler lines in it. And then of course it has the apple salad um, recipe. So that one I came in, um, and then I got my monthly um, adorn it. They come in these really cute envelopes. They stamp this in the front of your envelope all the time. Okay, so this here. This one is uh, the add-on for your monthly uh, subscription. It's a cute little co uh, hot cocoa cup with a snowman face on it. And you got this snowman with the big tall hat. And in this hat, it says, let it snow. This one here has like a little sign and you can put little sentiments in it. Let me see what this sentiment says. Um, snowflakes for sale. So you can put the little um, sentiment in here. It's so cute. And then you got this little guy over here. And I like these small ones too because you can put this um, in like a window or um, there's so many different things that you can do with the small images. So that one came in, and then the main uh, stamp came in. This one came separate. I don't know. I didn't get them on the same day. I was a little bummed, but then they finally came in the next day. I was hoping it wasn't lost um, again. So this is the hot cocoa um, recipe with the snowman. And you get the little mittens and the snowflakes for the background and the little swooshies for, like, the cold air. And then snowflakes. It's really, really cute adorable so that was from adorn it okay and then i um got some penny black in from uh scrapbook.com and at the time when i ordered uh this was free so this was a kathleen pooler reindeer stamp set and it was free with the order at the time really really cute so i got that but this was my order from scrapbook.com. I ordered Penny Black. This is Snowman Hugs. I love Penny Black, you guys. If I haven't already said that and you, you didn't already know that. Love, love, love Penny Black. They're having like a snowball fight. She's building the snowman, putting the carrot in the snowman's nose. This one here is rolling up a snowball. Um, she's got a little teddy bear on her sled that she's pulling. And then this one here is giving the snowman a great big hug. And her little sleigh is right there. Isn't that cute? Oh my gosh. So cute. You guys, I ordered so many winter Christmas stamps that there's no way I'm going to use all of them <clears throat> before um, Christmas. But I think I'm going to just do Christmas throughout the year. So, um, yeah, because I just absolutely love it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me get a sip of something here. That's my coffee. I, it's a Yeti cup that Gigi, Gigi's husband, gave to my husband. But I use it because it keeps my coffee hot all day long. But the, the lid 
it don't let a lot of coffee out <laughs> so when you're sipping it, it, it you can hear yourself sipping so excuse me if that if you heard that <laughs> um i forgot to show you the back isn't that pretty that is so pretty so that was one of the images i like when they color up images and you can see them on the back okay this one's called snow cute snow cute and it kind of, all three of these are kind of going to go, you can mix and match them. Because here we have another, um, and this is a little girl or a little boy. And this one here is the bear, um, the bear throwing the snowball. And you have the little mailbox. This little bear is putting mail in there. So cute. This one's adding a nose to a snowman. These are, these two are going down the hill on the sled. And that's really fun because you can make a card that has a hill and have them going down. And then here's a little snowman, but he's got little birds on his um hand on his little stick figured hands. This th he has a glove on this one, but he has a bird over here. And then this one's holding just a little stick walking through the snow. Super cute, and that's one of the colored images. Very pretty. Okay, and this one here is called Berry and Bright. Okay, so cute. Riding on the bicycle. Oh, these two right here, walking with their back and holding hands. That reminds me of my uh, two grandsons. They do this. They walk with their and hold hands. And there's a few pictures that their parents have taken with them like that. And it's just so cute. This one here is holding a sled, looking up. Here's a little branch with a bird singing. So this uh, little bear could look up and see the bird. Here's one with two on the sled. And this one's pulling it. And then there's an extra bird and some sentiments. And this is Berry and Bright. So those are my Penny Black. And then um, I went over to Greeting Farm. Um, a lot of these companies had uh, sales going on and stuff. But this one is called... Um, warm wishes and i absolutely love her her outfit and her scarf this little guy is holding a puppy and looks like hot cocoa you got a great big bow that you could put in her hair if you wanted to here's a little bear and the the sentiment so cute oh and the gifts very cute and then i got this one which is called miss anya amazing and this one comes with a chair with the Miss Anya sitting. So you put her in the chair. She has a laptop that you can put on the table, some books, a coffee cup, a little kitty, a plate of cookies. And this is like a little bow. Uh, it's a little flower bow that you could put like up here, a barrette in her hair. There's a table. You can set the laptop on in front of her couch. And then the sentiment says, um, you are absolutely amazing love that one and then i got this one and this is miss anya trendy and so we have three girls here this one i think is my favorite because the long hair glasses in her hair she looks like she's talking on her cell phone and then there's these little lines that you could put next to her because like you know when you talk um that would be like the symbol that you would put near someone that's talking it says you set the trend my friend and then here's the two other girls dressed up love the bracelets she has actually um okay so her hair goes i think this one has a hat on i think um and she has ponytails sticking out and then the back would be the hat um, and then she's got this cute little dress. This one's got shorts and a top. Really cute. And they don't put uh, pictures on the back. So, okay. Moving on. I went to Pixie Dust Designs. And I went over there because of Sybil. <laughs> Hi, Sybil. She had purchased some of the cups um, along with a lot of other YouTubers. And I just, I kept saying no, no, no. But I eventually went over and just did it, you guys. This is, a, I guess, a new company, Pixie Dust Designs. Or they could have been uh, around a long time, but it's new to me. 
Um, so this is the first cup that I bought and this one is the snowman cup. So cute. <clears throat> and then this one is the Santa cup. And that's what it looks like. And then we have, um, I thought there was one. Oh yeah, this one. This is Mrs. Claus. <clears throat> so you're gonna have Santa cup and Mrs. Claus. Very, very, very cute. Absolutely love, and I love that they're purple. Um, this is an add-on box. So if you wanted to make your cup into a little box to put some stuff in, you can do that with this die. So it creates the little box. You would just have to cut your cup out twice and have it um, on the front and on the back. Um, or you can just put it on the front. You don't have to have it on the back of the box, but this is the box and it does come with sentiments. Oh, here. So there's the box. Can you see it behind there? So your project would have um, like a 3D project and you could put stuff in it. And the sentiments, there's a couple back here. It says warm wishes, hot cocoa, Merry Christmas. Um, yeah, that's it. They're separate. That's why they look like there was more than that. Okay. And then I got this one, which was the gingerbread house. And that's what the house looks like. So cute. And then this is the last one I got. And this was the gingerbreads. This makes a boy or a girl. And there they are. And look at the donuts and the candy canes, the Christmas tree. So cute. They had um, a penguin one. I didn't get the penguin. Um, not this time. I, you know, I don't know why. It just, I didn't get the penguin. So those, those were some orders there. Then I went to Peachy Keen. Stamps came out with, uh, last year they came out with these stamps that were digitals. And um, to this time now she came out with them physical stamps, which I absolutely love. So the first one, um, they don't have names, I don't think. Oh, Gingerbread Bowl and Sentiments. So cute. So all those little gingers in a bowl. Adorable. Lots of sentiments. Here's a, even a little ginger shadow. Uh, and then there's some hearts in there. Some of the sentiments say cookies to and from. For the delicious thank you. Yummy. Um, the great cookie exchange, bake with love, especially for you, gingerbread cookies. So cute. And then, um, here's this one. Happy birthday to one sweet cookie. And there, look how big they are. They're a really good size, you guys. Let me measure this because they're bigger than what I thought. So they are about four and a quarter long, um, and wide they are. At the bottom, they're about two and a half, and in the middle, they're probably about two inches. Um, but yeah, that's a really good size stamp. Um, so I got this one, licking the little spatula. So funny. And then here's the little girl. She's licking the beaters, the blender beaters. I love her little dress. She's so cute and the flower on her head. <clears throat> and then here's another one. This one's got some gingerbread kids in her pocket. And it has hello there. And then this one is sending hugs and lots of love. Very, very cute. And then I got some sprinkles. Um, these are Pink It Up, it's called. So I got those. Um, this one is called Peppermint Party, and these are from Buttons, uh, morebuttons.com. So gingerbread and, and uh, peppermints. This one is Wintery Mix. It's got little uh, blue and white snowflakes. It's got um, some snowmen in there. It's really cute. And then this one here is called Santa's Treats. And there are gingerbreads, peppermints, and candy canes in here. 
So those. And then we're almost done, you guys. I went over to my creative time. Um, Gigi had gifted me a die from my creative time and it was an envelope to fit i believe it's to fit um this smaller one i'm not sure i'll have to look but the envelope um makes you know it's for your card your circle card bases so i got the four inch one so you would cut the big piece out, the figure eight, and fold it, and then you would score there, and you would get your card base, and then you have all these circles to create the layers of your card. So we got one, two, three, four that are plain circles, and four that are stitched. And it's called four inch circle card dies. And then these are the three inch. And with this one, you get an extra circle here. But the same thing, you get the little card that you can put together. And these would be so cute to make note cards. And like if you did like a D-stash or if you just want to send a gift to someone or, or a Happy Meal or something, this would be perfect for a little note card to go in your package. And then I ended up getting this one too. And this is called Circle Card Add-On. So these would be just different design bases that you could use and put on your card. So those are the three dies that I went over my creative time and got. And then I had to get the paper, you guys. The paper is just so darn cute. And this paper pad is called uh, Gingerbread Kisses. And I bought two so I wouldn't run out. You get the gingham colors up here, and then you get the peppermints and the gingerbread. Really, really cute. So I got two of those. And then this one, I got two of these, and this is called Gingerbread Kisses. And what was this? This is Gingerbread. This is Gingerbread Kisses, too. Hmm. It doesn't... Gingerbread Kisses 20, 2022. Gingerbread Kisses 2022. I guess it's the same name. It's just different colors because these are like more like your pastels. And these are more solid colors in your gingham. And it has peppermints and words and the little ginger inside the cup. So cute. Look at these adorable paper. So I got those, two of those. And that's all I got at my creative time. And then I went Scrap Diva Designs, of course. I went back over there. This is our little card with all her information um, that comes in your package. And over there, I ended up getting the Berry Basket. Um, she does have a Berry Basket 3D. I didn't get the 3D one because um, I don't think this is a 3D. This is a flat one, I think. Um, I have a Sizzix die that makes a 3D berry basket. So I didn't want to get the um, the 3D one. I just bought this here, and this is the flat one. So I got that. And then I got the Ferris Wheel Memory Dex card. This has been around, around for a while. I think this came out last year. But because Valentine's Day is coming and stuff, I figured I would grab it. So you have your heart and then your Ferris Wheel heart. And then you have the little cars that you could put on the Ferris wheel to go around. And then these little um, heart-shaped, I think. Hmm. I'll have to look at her sample on, on her page to see what these are. Because there's two little, um, they look like hole attachers or something or other. But I don't, I'm not sure. But you get the Ferris wheel part for the memory decks. And you just add your Ferris wheel on. So I got that one. And then lastly, I just picked up the heart um, memory decks. So it comes like that. And then you get extra pieces in the back if you want to make it a shaker um, or just decorate it. So you get three extra dies in the back. And that's it, you guys. That is enough. Holy moly. I, I, I need to stop. The first of the year, I need to put my foot down and... And tell myself, use what you already bought because it's crazy. And these companies, they just keep coming out with more and more and more. And so many cute things. It's so hard not to go over and buy them. But um, I'm going to try. Fingers crossed. I can't make any promises. But um, yeah. So thank you so much, everybody, for coming over. And happy holidays if I don't uh, have a video before then. 
um, many blessings to you and your family. And let's uh, go for good health and, and uh, you know, relaxing, better, better world. I mean, it's crazy out there. It's really crazy. I'm hoping this year is a little better, but I don't know. My, I think uh, it's only getting worse. But, but we have to stay positive. We have to stay positive. We have to do what we love and live each day to the fullest and be thankful that we are here still on this earth. So um, that's what we got to do. Stay positive, everybody. All right. We'll let you go. Thanks for watching. Blessings. Bye, everybody.